In today's video, I'm very excited to bring you this combination. It's a combination that wasn't possible until this season, and it's just style points galore. It's flash. It's effective. It is crispy. It is all of the things that we like in Destiny 2. Today, I'm showing you the long arm. I know you've probably seen a few videos on this gun, but I'm bringing you my take, and I'm telling you why this gun is so damn special in this video. What role you want to get, I'm going to show you all of the roles that I have farmed as well. So as always, guys, new year, same me. We need those likes. We need those subscribes. I hope everything is going well for you guys so far. This is the year that we hit 200,000 subscribers, hopefully. So I hope you guys are ready for the content this year. And I'm excited to get right into this video. So let's take a look at my long arm collection. I was in the Spire of the Watcher trying to get that cheeky little cowboy hat. It never dropped for me, but my consolation prize was all of these long arms. And I got a bunch of them. Rapid hit, adrenaline junkie, rapid hit, high impact, rapid hit, opening shot, which is the role that I absolutely coveted the most. But in the end, we settled on this one right here. It has subsistence and opening shot, but it's got chambered, it's got steady rounds, it's got stability masterwork, and it's got opening shot. Those are the four traits I absolutely wanted, and I'm really, really happy with it. 97 recoil direction when you add a counterbalance stock on this compared to DMT's 89 recoil direction. However, we wanted rapid hit because with two stacks of rapid hit, you get plus 12 stability. If you have 60 stability and opening shot plus rapid hit, that means when you get your kill shot, when you're ready for your kill shot, you're going to have a stability statistic or stability value rather of 72. And obviously you're going to have opening shot helping you out for that first shot. And all of that together creates a weapon that is basically a dueling monster, in my opinion. And you could make a very, very strong argument that when it comes to ADS warfare, granted hip fire wise DMT, you know, that's DMT's world. We're just living in it, you know, X Mechanica traits on this weapon. I would not recommend it is not. If you think this is like DMT, it is absolutely not. This thing is all about that aim down sights feel. And when you get that specific role that I mentioned, or even just my role here, even though we've got subsistence, which is only feeding us a bullet or two into the mag, which is still not bad. You know, even though we've got subsistence, we have 60 stability and opening shot. You don't need to go for range on this gun, even with 50 range. By the way, can you see that guy? Yes, 2020 vision coming at you hot. I could see him. Could you see him? Could you see him? If you couldn't see him, smash that like button for me at least. You owe me that much, hey? You owe me that much. Now we've got a Stormcaller coming with his only move. He's like when a Pokemon at level 5 only knows tackle. That storm callers with that teleport melee. I don't blame them though. They've got literally nothing else. I've got nothing left. Warlocks everywhere, probably. These guys be busy being laning Larry's. Didn't see me. And all of a sudden, bubble in the face. Bing, bang, boom. Oh yeah, by the way, another reason why this is better than DMT. Uh, you see this weapon I'm using with it? The Chaperone. Yes, the Chaperone is a good gun, ladies and gentlemen. You might not know it, or maybe you do. Weapons of light, 100 to the head. Very beautiful, very cheeky. But yeah, being able to pair up a Tex Mechanica Scout Rifle, Lever Action, Repeater, Rifle, Red Dead Redemption 2, Arthur Morgan, you know what I'm saying? I love all that shit, right? Being able to pair that up with the Chaperone, well, that just, you know, that makes me feel kind of fuzzy inside. I don't know about you guys, but that alone is a reason to use this weapon. Look at me, I'm out here in the sticks, mate. I'm in the snow, mate. I've got a, I've got a ghillie suit on. I'm just here waiting. Unsuspecting angle. I'm in their spawn. <laughs> And look, pup, pup, where's the last guy? It's just so satisfying getting three shots with this gun. I actually absolutely love it. I just love the animation of the gun when it kicks. I don't know what it is, but chaining headshots with this gun is just satisfying. I think it's that Tex Mechanica DNA, you know, and being able to pair Sharpon up with this gun really does. You know, when something just feels right. Yeah, this is one of those situations. It just feels right, man. It just feels right. Look at that. Bang, the little swap. Having two guns with spicy swap animations is something else, my friends. It really, really is. It truly is really crispy. Obviously, we're on trials in eternity in this gameplay because what else, you know, what better place could you find to showcase our DMT mini, our DMT light, our legendary DMT, the long arm, long arm of the law and with weapons of light. My goodness, look at the damage we are pulling off here, my friends. Just a fantastic combination. And I know people have probably done videos on this gun already. And I know you're probably loving all those videos too. But this really does showcase it. And I feel like every time I pop off with a chaperone like that, I'm also popping off for the long arm. You know what I'm saying? Because the long arm can be paired with the chaperone. Look at this. Bang. That, that was just satisfying. You know that, that long gun animation pulled out in his face. Just one bullet to the dome piece and he's done. After a little shoulder charge. Yeah, it is just beautiful. 
It's absolutely beautiful. And he's in a rift. It doesn't matter because with weapons of light, this gun is absolutely disgusting, my friends. We're playing Void in this gameplay. Yesterday, we did a video in Trials using a Duskville grenade build, and that's a way to counter Titan shields. Today, we are part of the problem, though, however. I mean, we were part of the problem yesterday as well, actually. <laughs> but yeah, if you haven't seen yesterday's video, make sure you go and check it out. If you're enjoying the video and you still haven't hit like, well, then hit like how I just shoulder charge that guy in the face. And here, I'll even throw in some hip fire shots for you. And that's the last time you're going to see me hip fire this gun. I can assure you of that much, my friends. Because, yeah, hip firing with this gun, not so great. This is something I love doing on this map, taking ridiculous flanks all the way around. Hey, you might want to look behind you, lads. I know you're playing Laning Larry over there, but listen, mate, flanking Franklin is on the loose. And he's behind a barricade, but I'm going to back myself to hit my shots. And look at that. Bing, bang, boom. This gun is beautiful, lads. If you get that roll, if you have the roll that I'm talking about, rapid hit, opening shot, 60 stability. Let me just tell you, you're a lucky son of a gun. I also recommend chambered compensator and counterbalance stock. So you get that 97 recoil direction. You get 74 stability on that final third shot if you just hit two crits. You've got opening shot for the first bullet. Everything is happening with this gun when you ADS it. DMT, forget about it. We don't, you know, come on, huh? I don't want to hear that word in this house again. Here, this is one of those ones. I'm 1v3. I'm going on a long flank. I'm being sneaky. Not much is happening, but it's one of those situations where once it starts happening, it doesn't stop happening. You know, one man comes in for a fusion. Another man wants to peek, but I've got this fusion. He's dead. He shoulder charged me. Chaperone to the face. They're all gone. Uh, that escalated quickly, I guess, and that'll happen sometimes in Destiny 2, The Crucible. These fellas not paying attention to their flank and you know what the long arm of the law is here to make them realize the error of their ways always look at the radar my friends always look at the radar radar is your friend my friends so make sure you look at it this guy we're in hot pursuit he's all the way in the back of the map i'm gonna push out here nope i don't think so it's time to wrong warlock uh we've got a warlock uh, escaping north over uh, he thinks he's tough but guess what he ain't tough my friend he might kill my blueberry though god damn it but bank target down over that is the end of the video my friends hope you guys enjoyed this one if you did don't forget to leave a like drop a comment subscribe all that good stuff and i will see you guys in the next video peace out